The Washington Commanders have signed tight end Zach Ertz. What is going on, everybody? It's your boy, Bula, coming at you with another video for the channel. Welcome back to the Game Sports Zone. I know it's been a while. Uh, I just got back home from break, spring break. You know, I've been bouncing a lot of stuff that's been happening in my life. I've been trying to balance it, at least, with school and YouTube and the Commanders. A lot of recent things has happened. I know I've been lacking with the content, so hopefully I'll get it running back up soon. But this, I saw, saw this news like five minutes ago, so I had to make a video about it. Zach Ertz, former... Tight end for the Arizona Cardinals is now a Washington commander. The deal is one year, five million. So right off the bat, I think that's amazing. That's a very, very cheap, cheap deal. A solid move for a veteran presence that knows the offense with Cliff, as he was with Cliff Kingsbury in Arizona and can mentor a tight end, hopefully, because I don't think he's gonna be a tight end one, or at least he's not gonna be the main, like we're not gonna roll with just him. We're hopefully gonna draft a young tight end and get him involved. There was a uh, speculation, oh not speculation, there was uh reports that they were talking uh zach arch was talking to the team today so i think just like that they just find out hey like we're interested in you as his team was like okay let's work out the details and now zach Ertz is a tight end for the washington commanders man if you told me a couple years ago when he was in the philadelphia eagles that he'd be a washington commander i would lose my mind sort of similar to when the eagles signed ryan kerrigan it's just so weird to see you go to a division rival and just play for them but i i like him i like it i really do Considering the fact that there's similarity with him in Arizona with Cliff and Cliff, hopefully, just hopefully brings in that young tight end uh, in the draft and they could somehow make it like a two tight end offense, you know, scheming Zach Ertz wide open. I think he still has some juice in the tank when he was uh, with the Eagles. I can pull up the stats right now. Actually, he had a pretty, pretty good career. I think he was a pro bowl at one point two with Philadelphia in 20. Oh, sorry, he was with the Lions at one point before, something like that. So in 2023, he had 27 receptions, 187 yards, and one touchdown. But for his career in general, I think his – so I think the year we went to the Pro Bowl was 2018 with the Eagles. He had 1,163 yards of total yards, uh, 116 receptions, wow, eight touchdowns. Wow, that is – averaged over 10 yards to catch. That is something. So Zach Ertz, I mean, people forget that he was really good when he was uh, with the Eagles, and hopefully, just hopefully, Cliff Kingsbury, with hopefully this quarterback they bring in, can revamp his career somehow. And if not revamp, just mentor a young guy that we bring in. But I'm excited, bro. Uh, Zach Ertz again. We clear the books off of cutting Logan, Charles Leno, Nick Gates, which I'll make a separate video on. We cleared the books, and we get a cheap deal in Zach Ertz, a tight end who maybe has something to prove. Sort of like a similar situation when we brought in Adrian Peterson. Now, mind you, he's not Adrian Peterson was a different breed. I'm not gonna say Adrian Peterson's gonna. I mean, Zach Ertz is gonna ball like Adrian Peterson did when he was when he signed here in Washington. But I will say though, at most, mentoring a young tight end is what we need, especially if I if and I think most probably 99 sure that we're gonna draft the QB at two. We got to make sure that our QB has a tight end because we haven't really had a. a adequate tight end i mean you could say logan his first year here but ever since the injury and everything I'll age too jordan reed was probably our best tight end at one point he was up there with gronk and kelsey but yeah i think even zach Ertz, when he was at his prime jordan reed was there too at least i think so but yeah zach Ertz is a washington commander i'm excited the guys this is the first move hopefully uh more free agents they're very cautious about who they're signing not giving out a lot of money like they used to do with the dan snyder era Cam Curl, speculation about him leaving. I'll make a video about that, too. All in all, I'm happy that Zach Ertz is a Washington commander. Very, very cheap deal. Let's keep it going. Hey, the commanders, make sure to like, comment, subscribe to the channel, and we're out. Peace.